France honors teacher beheaded for blasphemy one year after his death. Um, so when I'm talking about this news, I'm going to be saying Terryism repeatedly. When I say this, I am referring to violent radical extremism or the T word. I think we all know what I'm talking about now. Okay. Now that I've said that, I'm going to continue. On October 16th, schools across France paid homage in memory to the death of the the in memory of the first year anniversary death first year death anniversary of Samuel Paty. Paty was a 47-year-old school teacher who was murdered in 2020 because he showed his classroom cartoon depictions of the Prophet Muhammad during a lesson about free speech. His murderer Abdullah uh, Anzorov, a 18-year-old Chechen, was killed during a confrontation with the police. French President Emmanuel Macron, commenting on Pati's murder, said that he was killed because he was because he represented the secular democratic values of the French Republic. Pati was honored with a commemorative plaque outside the Ministry of Education that reads, "Homage to Samuel Pati, murdered by an Islamic." for teaching and defending the values of the Republic, including freedom of expression. Several schools have been named after Pati, including a school in the multi-ethnic suburb of Valentin, and he will also be um, commemorated by having a square named after him in uh, this other major university. Um, so I wanted to cover this news because I thought it was also important to remember the um, first year anniversary of Samuel Pati's death. Um, it happened in October 2020. And um, I think this event um, is having such massive ripple effects that is actually going to be of incredible importance in the news we cover later today in regards to Pakistan. And I think um, in, it is also kind of symbolic in, any way, in many ways of this, um, as we become a more globalized world and society, um, continuing clashes and fights over the freedom of, of expression. And his death was, um, an extremely poignant and um, horrible and painful reminder of exactly how important um, the freedom of expression is and why we need to protect it. Um, yeah. Armin, do you have anything you'd like to add? Um, yeah. The memor what was it? The memorial? What did I say? The plaque? What is it called? The, um, the commemorative plaque? Yes. Was that made by the government? Yes. And on it says he was killed by Islamic. Like it has the word Islam on there. That's what was reported. That's a oh wow. Okay. Friend, uh, France's government doesn't hold back this. <laughs> They're like. <laughs> Wait, what are your thoughts on that? I mean, that I caught mean, my attention. Be, you did? Yeah, right. Like, it's not <laughs> just me, huh? Like, if it was other government, it would be like, if it was like, I don't know, Canada's government or UK's government or US's government, and they went ahead to plaque, they would be like, he was killed by radicals, like people, evil people, or something like that. They wouldn't put the word Islam on there. But France is like, we're we're gonna, we're gonna say we're gonna say it we're gonna say we're gonna say what happened so yeah i guess I, yeah i admired it actually france is like not holding back wow i was like no chills going on the ministry of education's building okay <laughs> right 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 okay um, um i think we should make um art in his memory what do you think maybe we can talk about that yeah i i kind of like that idea that could be cool yeah. Um, I think there were a couple of other poignant comments that I wanted to read when, uh, from other people in France commenting on this. So, um, 
uh, French Prime Minister Jean Cassex said, here is a man who wanted to do his job, a demanding and sometimes thankless job, a man who only inspired to transmit the values of freedom, secularism, tolerance, free will, Cossack said on Saturday and while unveiling um, this plaque in the presence of um, Pati's family. Um, and then he continued saying, uh, Samuel Pati was a victim of Islamist uh, terrorism and human cowardice. Um, underlining that paying tribute to him was also a way of supporting the Republican project, meaning the uh, the project of the French Republic. Um, his family will also be meeting with uh, President Emmanuel Macron, uh, or they did meet on the day of that unveiling. Um, there was also a really good quote that I wanted to read. Um, just a second. Oh yeah, so the education minister was also speaking, saying the French Republic won't abandon its values of freedom and democracy. Um, he he was doing what was expected from a teacher to transmit knowledge, and we will never forget him. Um, there were also people talking about um, how he was, where was it, like, Macron when commenting on his murder and saying how he reflected and represented these values that are so central to the French Republic was saying Islamists want to take our future and they will never have it. And that's also something that's very important to talk about how in the wake of this murder, France has issued all of these very controversial laws to prevent Islamist separatism. Um, I think in the actual bill, it didn't say Islamists. I think it said religious or maybe just to prevent separatism um, good, because good. Really, Macron yeah. was so concerned about the formations of these separate societies that don't share the values of the French Republic, which includes secularism and defending free expression, which mm -hmm. means includes the whole point of it is to defend that which other people find offensive. Um, if the bill had, if the, the okay, the, the plaque I'm in support of is saying is long. But if the bill mentioned Islam, I would have been against the bill. I'm glad that the bill says religion and not Islam. It should be every religion. So I'm glad. I'm glad. Um, by the way, we have this person. There's a we have a Muslim and I mean maybe a troll. I don't know if it's actually real. Okay, and this is what they're saying. This could be a troll. It could be serious. But I'm just like, you just want or it could it. be a follower of um, Gautam Hussein Rizvi, who we will be talking about later today with the the TLP party. Oh, yeah. The uh... oh yeah yeah yeah. Oh my gosh. Well, former former. Yeah. Uh, leader. So Quite... the implications yeah. of this death actually have huge um, implications in a way uh, for the relationship of France and Pakistan. But also, yeah, I mean, we'll get... Pakistan's relationship with the EU, like all this stuff, it's it's crazy how much it it's will get to... expanded. And um... oh, look at this. Okay, I I'm actually more I, okay. I'm actually more uh, pissed with you right now. Okay, because <sighs> people come here and jo joke, and I always say like it could be a joke or it could be real, and they're like it was a joke, buddy. Well, how, look at this. How could you tell? Is there like a sarcasm sign? Is there like a forward slash S? Is there like an emoji with the tongue How are out? we supposed to like, tell when people actually are, say this? <laughs> do you think we could like read minds across the internet? Like, like that was a, you like, I'm no Muslim. Well, how can we tell? Like, that's why I said it could be serious or a troll. And apparently you ended up being a troll. So you like, you're like, oh, I mean, can't tell it. It's a joke. Like it's text. It's text. You cannot tell that it's a joke or serious. Okay. Okay. Anyways, I'm gonna get the next news. I'm yeah, actually so more pissed with you now as an as a as a not a Muslim for thinking that you can read your minds <laughs> than what you wrote as a Muslim. Okay. Anyways, Atheist Republic needs your help. We have been the target of many legal attacks by Hindu nationalists ever since our founder, Armin Ababi, blasphemed against Hindu deities. We have retained legal counsel to help us defend our access to our community in India. 
We have started a fundraiser that will help us afford to tackle many legal issues, including judicial harassment and censorship. Whatever you can contribute will go a long ways in helping us in this fight. Link in the description below.